Now suppose I wanted to describe all the points that are a distance of 5, a distance of 5 from the point 1, 3, 2. Now think to yourself, what kind of shape would this describe? All the points that are equidistant from the point 1, 3, 2. Now, you may, this may sound familiar, we did something similar in two dimensions that gave us a circle because we had a point, all the points an equal distance away formed a circle. Now in three dimensional space, if we have a point, all the points equal distance away are going to form a ball or more formally a sphere. And so this is going to give us a sphere. Now let's use our distance formula to find an equation. So if a point is distance of 5 from 1, 3, 2, let's call the point the point x, y, z, and we want to describe all the points that are distance of 5 from here. So using the distance formula, we want a distance of 5, and so that we can use the center point here along with the other point on our sphere here uh, to, to set up our equation. So we're going to have difference of the x's squared, difference of the y's squared, plus the difference of the z's squared. And there is an equation for this sphere. Uh, sometimes you may see this written instead, uh, squaring both sides as uh, x minus 1 squared, y minus 3 squared, and z minus 2 squared equaling 25 or equaling 5 squared. That's the equation of a sphere.